They're all loaded, the light flash in there, and the rollers, and they're all away for the race feature. The Trinidad Turf Club Cup and is a comfort so racing to us for the first time. And now Lord the Rail is the one who seems to want to pick it up with Green Hills on the outside. Windy Hill, the favorite, is being tacked across to the rail. And then comes General Street racing wide with Beulah Land. All of these are going up. And four of them are now disputing the lead as they race uh, in front of us for the first time. General Street going on on a tight rein from Manalu, who's been pushed along with Beulah Land on the outer. Green is on the inside. Windy Hill tucked in on the rail in a good position. Merely Mozart, Jim Ford, and Country Warrior. These three just about two and a half lengths of drift as they go around that bottom corner. They've got just over 1,300 meters to race, and the three of them are really hotly contesting the lead. General Street just the lead in the middle from Manalu on the inside, and Beulah Land on the outside. Three and a half lengths back in fourth, it's Green Hills and Windy Hill going up now, taking closer order and looking very ominous as they go up the back stretch. They've now got 900 meters to race and the leader is General Street by half a length from Manaldo. A length back in third is Beulah Land and Windy Hill closing fast in fourth. Green A is making ground in fifth, Jump Father getting into the action and then comes Country Warrior and Mary Mozart out of it. Towards the 600 meter mark of the race and General Street has made its bid and goes two and a half lengths clear of Manaldo. In third, it's Beulah Land, in fourth, Windy Hill, and this one is having trouble to get into top gear. And then comes Jim Father, who's making ground, but it's General Cheek by three from Manalo. Windy Hill is in third, and in fourth on the outside, that's Country Warrior, who's making a tremendous amount of ground. As they race to the top of the stretch, they've got 350 meters to go. And the leader is General Street, the leader from Windy Hill, who's coming to challenge. On the outside, Country Warrior is in third. And General Street is being challenged strongly now by Windy Hill. But they've got 200 meters to go. And it's General Street who's holding Windy Hill, who's coming to challenge. And General Street is going to hold on from Windy Hill. And Windy Hill putting in his effort, but General Street is going to win by two and a half lengths. A comfortable winner. Second is Windy Hill. Third is Country Warrior, who ran a corker. Green Hills is next, Jim Ford and Mary Mozart and the early uh, other leaders, Manaldo and Beulah Land, last of the lot. This race, tremendous excitement as they passed in front of the grandstand for the first time. The roar went up, it was really great. And here, a winner comes back, people are all over the parade ring. And here comes Gary Hearn, the trainer and the owner, and what work he's done with this horse. Tremendous um, faith he has had in him, and look at his, his, his handlers all coming back. And that must be the whole of Gary Hearn's um, stable there with him, all his grooms and stuff, he and his wife, and uh, really, look at him, a proud owner and trainer of a tremendous horse, and that gives Winston Walls and his third win for the day, a tremendous performance by him as well. Came back here only a couple of years ago, started riding again, and really, Winston Walls and rides General Street, the victory, the favorite again has been beaten, will be seen that in three races.